Good day, everybody. Today we are going to talk about volume by shell method. So without further ado, I'll share my computer screen with you. So this is a problem on volume by shell method. Problem, use the shell method to set up and evaluate the integral that gives the volume of the solid generated by revolving the plane region about the x-axis. So y is given as square root of x minus two, y equal to zero and x equal to four. These are the boundaries, okay? So volume by shell method is given as v equal to two pi integration between a and b, the limits p of x multiplied by h of x and dx. Now p of x is equal to x here, okay? And h of x is equal to square root of x minus two. Now y is given by square root of x minus two. So when y is zero, x is two, okay? So the volume is, okay, two pi integration from lower limit of two x, to upper limit of four and <clears throat> P of X is X and H of X is square root of X minus two X times square root of X minus two DX. Now we do some substitution that U equal to X minus two or X is equal to U plus two. So DU is equal to DX. When X is equal to two, U is equal to zero. And when X is equal to four, U is equal to two. So we plug it in, v is equal to two pi. For x, we write u plus two, and square root of x minus two is u to the power of half du. So the integration limits are between zero and two in u. So two pi, then we do the integration. So you multiply u to the power of half with u, which is u to the power of three by two, plus two u to the power of half. An integration of u to the power of three by two is u three by two plus one, which is u five by two. In the denominator is five by two, which when inverted, it becomes two by five. Similarly, for the next term, it's two u to the power of half. Integration is u to the power of three by two divided by three by two in the denominator, where two moves to the numerator when inverted. So four over three is the coefficient of u to the power of three by two, okay? Now we put the limits. So volume is equal to two pi, two fifth, u to the power of five by two is, u to the power of five by two is, uh, the limits are zero to two. So it is two to the power of five by two, zero. You can forget it because zero is zero. And then the other one is four third, two to the power of three by two. So this is two pi square root of two, and then we have inside two fifth times four plus four third, four third times two, which is finally, if we simplify volume is 128 square root of two pi divided by 15. So I'll stop here today. If you have any questions, leave me a comment and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. I appreciate that. And please subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the bottom right corner. I'll come back next time with another problem, another solution. Okay, take care. Have a nice day. I'll see you next time.